the secret is out. <laughs> Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 celebrity fans of Star Wars. Before we begin, we publish new videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. For this list, we're ranking the most diehard, vocal, or long-standing fans of the Star Wars franchise that also happen to enjoy celebrity status. <laughs> Number 10. Anna Kendrick Okay, so we all know it's nothing new for you and your friends to geek out over the latest Star Wars trailer, but we gotta admit it's pretty cool when celebrities get in on the act. Case in point, Anna Kendrick's excited reactions on Twitter about the release of Star Wars Episode 7 The Force Awakens, a cool reminder that the Star Wars universe can connect with the kid in all of us. Oh, and Ms. Kendrick gets bonus points for going the extra mile to appear in the live-action trailer for the 2015 video game Star Wars Battlefront, securing her status as a sci-fi superfan. If you strike me down, I shall become more powerful than you can possibly imagine. Number 9. Topher Grace Have you ever wanted to cut your own version of a film? Edit it down to your own personal specifications? Don't try it! Well, that's what that 70s show star Topher Grace did with his version of George Lucas's Star Wars prequels. The actor, who is a huge fan of the series, was looking to hone his skills as a film editor and chopped the first three episodes in the franchise down to one 85-minute film. Grace has only screened the film once for a group of friends, and due to copyright, it remains unavailable for public consumption. Don't do that again. Still, the fact that he went to such trouble indicates that his midi-chlorian count is off the charts. Number 8. Bill Hader Bill Hader's love of the Star Wars universe has been well documented. Like that time the actor and comedian indulged in some spot-on impressions as a guest on The Conan Show. I can do job with the hut dying. Yeah. Let okay. me hear it. <laughs> Peter's dreams of actually becoming involved in the franchise came true, however, when he was given a voice consultant credit on director J.J. Abrams' The Force Awakens. Peter collaborated with actor Ben Schwartz to create the sounds that would ultimately constitute the voice of adorable droid BB-8. Even so, Hayter was surprised when Abrams gave him credit for his work on the final product. Number 7. Neil Patrick Harris Kids and adults alike love dressing up in their favorite Star Wars costumes for Halloween. Neil Patrick Harris and his adorable family took it one step further in 2015, however, when they all got into the Star Wars cosplay act. Is it time you got rid of your stupid doll? It's not a doll, it's a stormtrooper. The former star of How I Met Your Mother, his husband David Burka, and their two kids got down in OG trilogy attire as Obi-Wan Kenobi, Han Solo, and Luke and Leia respectively, furthering a tradition in their household of posting fun, festive Halloween photos on a yearly basis. Number 6. Emma Stone The YouTube clip for Stand Up to Cancer was published by the Star Wars franchise as a means of boosting donations and awareness, while at the same time showing its celebrity ambassadors having a good time with their favorite Star Wars quotes. Help me, Obi-Wan Kenobi. You're my only hope. <laughs> it's Emma Stone's presence in the clip that most impresses us, however thanks to her earnest delivery and obvious love of the source material. I want to learn the ways of the Force and become a Jedi like my father. Stone also had a bit of fun on Saturday Night Live, in a sketch where the actress delivered a mock audition for the part of Rey in The Force Awakens. Emma Stone, Javier Bardem, chemistry test. If the First Republic takes over the galaxy, then everyone you love is doomed. Isn't all we have the says? What? Number 5. Joseph Gordon-Levitt The average red carpet premiere may be full of tuxedos and extra fancy dresses, but all bets are off when Hollywood celebrates the Star Wars universe. Actor Joseph Gordon-Levitt definitely got into the space spirit when he appeared at the premiere of Episode 7 in a homemade Yoda costume. The handmade creation combined green face paint, pointy ears, and pajama pants to earn Gordon-Levitt an A for effort, even if the end result wasn't exactly screen accurate. I'm looking for someone. Looking? Found someone you have, I would say, hmm? Number 4. Stephen Colbert 
Stephen Colbert has made no secret of his undying love for the Star Wars universe. Even going so far as to humorously explain a summarized plot of the original trilogy to China on The Late Show. People in China aren't that familiar with Star Wars movies. Though they might be familiar with some of the toys. And... It's the friendly rivalry between Colbert and his buddy Jon Stewart that gives us the giggles, however. When the pair battled it out to see who was the biggest Star Wars fan for the online fundraising platform Omaze. Stewart and Colbert appeared to raise money for a Lucasfilm UNICEF campaign, where both put their trivia knowledge and lightsaber skills to the test. John, I thought we were just going to do a trivia contest, you know, a simple question like, what cell was Princess Leia kept in? Which obviously was... 287! Number 3. Simon Pegg And I did this. <laughs> Hollywood's King of the Geeks may have voiced Jakku Junker Unkar Plutt in The Force Awakens. One quarter portion. But that's not where Simon Pegg's involvement with the franchise ended. In fact, director J.J. Abrams actually applauded Pegg's involvement on the set as a consultant during an interview with Entertainment Weekly, where Abrams said that Pegg was, quote, an honest, critical friend with, quote, fresh eyes and very smart ideas. It may be the average Star Wars fan's dream to actually contribute to the creative process, but in Simon Pegg's case, it's simply a case of getting the right man for the job. Number 2. Tina Fey What? It's the only white dress I own. The Star Wars references flew frequent and fast back on Tina Fey's 30 Rock. Whether it was the writer, actress, and comedian dressing up as Princess Leia, or Carrie Fisher herself showing up. I grew up wanting to be you. I grew up wanting to be Samantha Stevens on Bewitched. And Faye's love of the franchise continues to inspire her appearances today. She even appeared on the 42nd season of Saturday Night Live in hologram form to give hosting tips to Rogue One star Felicity Jones. You must get this message to J.J. Abrams. Tell him I am technically available to act in films. It's impossible to get enough Tina Fey, but it's hard not to love her even more when she's dropping love for the Star Wars universe. Before we name our number one celebrity Star Wars fan, here are some honorable mentions. You've never heard of the Millennium Falcon? Should I have? It's the ship that made the Kessel Run in less than 12 parsecs, which is a very good time. There ain't a lot of brothers out here, man, in space, right? It's like they're trying to keep us down, man. Well, you know, I, I don't think that it's a policy. I just think it's really, really difficult to get to this level. Number one, Seth MacFarlane. With Star Wars superfan Seth MacFarlane, it's a case of putting your creative money where your mouth is. How else can you explain the tremendous effort that went into MacFarlane's realization of three Star Wars parodies on Family Guy? I'm Han Solo, captain of the Millennium Falcon and the only actor whose career isn't destroyed by this movie. All three of the specials retold the original trilogy utilizing the Griffins and Company and displayed real love and respect for their source material while at the same time retaining the show's irreverent humor. Why, you stuck-up, half-witted, scruffy-looking nerf herder! You can't use that word! Only we can use that word! Laugh it up, Fuzzball. The Family Guy trilogy is proof positive that Seth MacFarlane deserves this spot as the ultimate celebrity fan of the Star Wars universe. No light speed? No light speed. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from WatchMojo and subscribe for new videos every day.